Emery taking charge of the open training session on Friday in his first game in charge of Arsenal, Emery saw his side draw with Atletico Madrid before losing on penalties. There were some areas of weaknesses in the back line seen in the first game against Diego Simeone's side. However, the Arsenal football team showed potential in their attack. The blistering pace of Pierre-Emerick Aubameyang often threatened the opponents and Aaron Ramsey started to find greater freedom in the midfield. Most will not take pre-season friendlies seriously. Premier League title winner, Manchester City, has already lost two of their friendlies in the United States of America. Many regular starters, who were involved in the World Cup 2018, have yet to return to their training. The first real test for Emery would be on August the 12th when he takes on Pep Guardiola's team at the Emirates. Emery named a strong starting 11 against Atletico Madrid in the Singapore National Stadium. Most of the youngsters only came on in the second half of the game after Emil Smith-Rowe scored the equaliser for his side. Many Arsenal players admitted that the team is still a work in progress, as they adapt to life under the 46-year-old manager. A number of youth players have caught the attention of fans with their performances in recent days. Here is a look at three of them who everyone should look out for in this upcoming season. The 20-year-old star is already making a name for himself, even though there is still plenty of hype on Reese Nelson and Eddie Nketiah. The problem with the latter two is that both have not quite proven themselves on the senior stage. On the other hand, Maitland Niles is one who has been consistently used by Arsene Wenger as a defender and as a midfielder. The opportunities that he had last season would surely have prepared him to face tougher challenges in the upcoming one. Even though Wenger is now no longer the manager of Arsenal, Emery seems confident that Maitland Niles would have a role to play in the club. Additionally, he was the only player who managed to score from the spot against Atletico Madrid on Thursday evening in a disappointing penalty shootout. The rest of the youngsters and Henrik Mkhitaryan were unable to convert their chance. He has played on various positions on the pitch during his time under Wenger. However, Maitland Niles mostly takes on a defensive role in the game where the French manager had felt that the player would be best in. The teen is extremely adept in taking set pieces, dribbling, and defensive contribution. With age catching up on Nacho Monreal and speculation that the Spaniard could return to Spain, Maitland Niles would be eager to step up whenever he has the chance to. The English player has always seen himself as a central midfielder. In the early stages of Emery's takeover, it would be hard to tell where the new manager would see his position on the pitch. Regardless of where he plays, the amount of potential he has is undeniable. Fans should look forward to more opportunities of seeing him play in the upcoming season. Topics you might be interested